a number of flight cancellations and delays across the country. And here in South Florida, that's led to checked bags being separated from travelers. WPTV News Channel 5's Josh Navarro live now at PBIA, where he spoke to some of those impacted passengers. Josh. Well, more than two dozen stranded suitcases are still here at PBIA. I'm told there was a whole lot more than what you're seeing right now. Close to 500 of them uh, late last night, and they've been here for about two days, and all of them from American Airlines. Some of the passengers I spoke to say their flights were canceled when they were making a connection in Dallas-Fort Worth over the weekend. Most of them I told they were put in hotels, but without their luggage because it was already on its way here to West Palm Beach. A spokesperson for American Airlines says a severe weather from the weekend led to air traffic control initiatives that restricted and resulted in a number of delays and cancellations. Apparently there's no issue with the luggage, so I got them. That's the most important thing for me. So I was worried that I wouldn't get them, but I yeah. And American Airlines says things progressed to normal operations today. There were today there were 17 flight delays and 12 cancellations, according to Flight Aware. For now, we're live at PBIA. I'm Josh Navarro, WPTV News Channel 5.